Hey guys, Rivetet here. Welcome back to another episode of The Vanishing of Ethan Carter. Where we're going to try to turn off this freaking noise we got here. And nothing I can do here? Sure, there's a lot of water sounds around here. Is that set of stairs going? Where are we going to go? Okay. Did I miss something? Oh god, I'm stuck over here. I just realized something. That, that door was closed behind us, isn't it? I remember looking at it, not even putting two and two together, but yeah, this door is shut. Okay, we can't open it. Okay, so we got that. So we're not doomed there. What the hell are we supposed to do here? There's got to be a reason to be in this building. I don't see anything in here. Let's double check it again. one of them is on. Ah, there you go. Maybe there's something I had to do. So is that, what does that mean out here? this man that'd be so cool can I go over here I would like to get in the water I don't know what the hell that did for me. I just know that it's no longer like churning over there. Let's just head out. It had to have done something out here. But we didn't go down very much further. Maybe there's more over there. Let's just go double check. We can always take that thing back up. If need be. So I'm pretty sure that we're going to have to solve those other puzzles before we can do anything else. Nice to not have to hear all that crazy water sound. Just kind of screwed down here. I 
I guess that was all we had to do down here. It didn't make a whole lot of sense. Did this door open? Nope, nothing here. I'm not going to walk across there. It just seems so weird that we were able to go across that pathway. Again, there's just weird paths around here all the time. Anyway, so just keep going. Just to go up the elevator thing. I can't think of what else we need to do around here. We could go back up and try to solve that body part one at the very beginning. And there's that other room one. So, I mean, I'm sure that there's a lot of puzzles I need to solve first. It's possibly what's blocking my progression along this is that I haven't solved everything. I do think you can actually solve things out of order, too. I don't feel like I've lost a whole lot of the storyline, though. That weird maze one, that was the only one that felt a little out of joint. I didn't really feel like it was part of the game so far, but everything else so far has seemed pretty good. I just didn't like that creepy guy that wrecked my day. At least I know now I can go back down there again whenever I want to. Because I got the elevator up here. Open the door. Okay, let's go solve that uh, body thing. Like, that one shouldn't be too hard. I mean, that's going to be the first puzzle you, you run across. And I just didn't understand what I was doing, so... Still a beautiful walk across here every time. Got no problems with it. Hope you guys are enjoying this so far, because I definitely am. It's a very odd, odd game. Not quite what I was expecting so far. I was expecting a lot more, like, story-driven stuff, where I'd, like, stumble across a lot more clues and, you know, things would be kind of... Not necessarily, like, like fed to me, but I would have you know, been doing a lot more sleuthing. I don't know, I guess, like, the, um... The Sherlock's... Again, I'm relating to the Sherlock Home games, because that one, there's a whole bunch of stuff to do. It's very similar with how it works, but you're constantly in the mix of the story, where this one, you just kind of feel like you're on the outskirts of it, then you stumble across part of it. Not discounting it. It's definitely had its creepy-as-hell moments, for sure. I've enjoyed the heck out of it. Okay, that body shouldn't be too far from here. Was it... I remember was it on which side of the uh, the trestle bridge? I think it's just on the other side of this. I'm trying to figure out like if you look at like how broken down this road and everything is, like how long has everything just been destroyed like this? It's gotta be a long, long time. Oh god, yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna have ways to go. I think it's on the other side of the trestle bridge. Or maybe. Just on the other side of this. That's right, we had to go down to the water and then back up. Okay. Yeah, we should be very close to it. Aha! I was not wrong to want to inspect the water. See, I knew something was up down here. Now, if I would found that the first time I came down here, why I didn't, I have no idea. I would have gone back up. I said, okay, what's that for? Okay, now, is there anything else down here? Just to make sure that I didn't overlook something. Aha, see? Again. Fresh dirt. Okay, so I need to find a rock. Dear God.
Broke her from the bridge? Oh, there's diesel fuel here too. So I know I saw the rail car up there. So you can find a rock and a rail car. This is going to be interesting. So we got. Okay, the touch probably still won't work. Yeah, we still got a ways to go, I assume. Yeah, I mean, I did not even find half of what we needed for it. Uh, make sure I didn't. There's a rock missing too, right? Now, I remember seeing the rail car up here, because that's one of the first things I stumbled upon. But I also have that weird contraption. Does that go to it? To the engine? Okay, inspect this. Crankshaft. Oh, look, it's got blood on it. Fix the crank. Interesting. Not like we haven't done this before. So we're gonna. I don't know if I'm supposed to be taking this down here. So, still need to find that rock. Oh, it's not in the thing, is it? Oh, we got it. Did we? Missing something. Okay, is there a rock mixed in here? Okay, let's see if go take this back up. I'm just gonna see if it goes back any further. So that's going to hit the the end. Turn her off. Okay, so we've got rail car. I did it. I got to bring the rail car back to there, don't I? Well, that's stupid. I think that does it. I'm not too sure. Sounds like a thing. I need to find the rock. So let's go take a look. Maybe it's up here where... Okay, so not the severed legs. There should be a rock. I don't know why the rope is here. That's just kind of weird. Sure there wasn't a rock sitting around here. So I don't want to go any further than there. It's gotta be back here someplace. We could try that weird trick we did the last time. Where we kind of aligned everything up. And remember we had the question marks? I don't know if that does anything for me, but figure it out. So there's that, the silver legs, the
There you, see, there you go again. Okay, it's next to a tree trunk up there. Okay. Oh, it's not... Oh, okay, I get it. Not too far from the uh, thing. Um... Still on this side? There it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's weird that I was looking on one side and it was right here. Okay, there you go. Take the rock, put the rock back. We should be able to do everything from here. Yeah, there's no way I would have been able to figure this out when I first started the game. That would have been nearly freaking impossible. Okay, now we got the ghostly screams. That means we should be able to solve said puzzle. I did all the canister. Let's just... There's only one way to test it, and that's to touch the body. See if we get our... There we go. Four? Should be alright. Is it? Yeah. Nope. Five. One here. Okay, so there's this one. down here still or did they go chronologically yet go down here yet yeah, there we go that is one Grab the rock, maybe bash somebody over the head. Yep, so that's going to be two. I think it's going to start with that one. I guess it does start with this. Gail, honey, I wish there was another way. Maybe I did it right. Tell me where he is. Nope. Okay, I think this is going to be the first one. So this is going to be previous. Let's visualize it. Listen to me. We can destroy it. I know how. You can't destroy it, Ethan. You can't destroy time. And that's what he is. He is forever. Interesting. We got two now. Travis, tell me where Ethan is. Now. I'm giving the sleeper what he wants. What all of us want. Look, old man. You need to go home. <gasps> Dear God. So the kid got free. Oh, man. Ethan, run, goddamn it. Go! Get out of here! Wow. What a messed up story. Close your eyes. I don't know if I'd want to learn that at the beginning. It's kind of interesting, like, the, 
you know, the direction I've taken this, I'm kind of intrigued by it. Okay, where are you going to go? Come on. Show me where you want to go. Of course. Grandpa? Stay away! Ethan, I'm sick too. I can feel the sleeper in my head. Then fight it! I have to destroy the room! Corvus. I'm sorry. Ethan. Oh no! I can't let you do that. Okay. Interesting, interesting, interesting. Whatever had turned Ethan's family against him, the grandfather was trying to resist. Age helps against those things that feed on hate. No kidding. Not because of wisdom or experience. Because the old are tired. Their hate is less useful. Wow. <laughs> I can tell you, my hate as I get older is doing a wonderful job for me. But anyway, there we go, guys. A little less out of joint and out of order, but we're getting there. Uh, I think next we got to do is that puzzle room thing. Maybe? We'll go take a look. I'm going to go and check and see if there's anything that I've overlooked. And uh, our next episode, I'll be back. And if I have something that I have to do around here still, I'll go and do that first. But anyway, I'll see you guys in our next episode. Take care, everybody. Bye-bye.